thoughts that haven't come to close. In what has been a history-making courtroom drama, Donald Trump has become the first former U.S. president to stand in a criminal trial. On being faced with 34 claims that allegedly he falsified business documents, the former president continually called the trial a sham and denied all wrongdoing. And that was just the start. Here are some of the key moments of Donald Trump's hush money trial. Firstly, the gag order. About certain things. And so being very careful, but you saw what happened. Trump violated his gag order 10 times, causing the judge to fine him $10,000 in total for contempt of court, and said he would consider jailing him if he continued to violate the order. Uh, I won't say that it's the money he, so I won't say that. In fact, you're going to have to get this one because I can't read it. I've, I've been gagged from reading this. Second, Stormy Daniels' description of her alleged sexual encounter with Trump. For almost four hours, Miss Daniels described intimate details about the alleged affair, which included how she met the former president, how he invited her back to his hotel, and his greeting in satin pajamas. Daniels testified that Trump told her that she reminded him of his daughter because she is smart, blonde, and beautiful. Third, the star witness Michael Cohen who admitted to stealing tens of thousands of dollars from the Trump Organization as part of his reimbursement plan with Donald Trump to recoup $130,000 for paying off Stormy Daniels in 2016. He testified that he pocketed $60,000 from his former boss by overstating the amount he paid a tech company that rigged online opinion polls in Mr. Trump's favor. Fourth, Costello cleared court. The defense witness was reprimanded by the judge, who at one point made all press and jury leave the court after Robert Costello continued to heavy sigh and eye roll to a series of objections to his testimony. And finally, the tragic scene outside court, where a protester set himself alight. 37-year-old Max Azzarello died after setting himself on fire on 19th of April outside the Manhattan courthouse where Trump was on trial. He posted a conspiracy-laden manifesto online moments before the incident. 